from the 19 News Studios. Driven by the injury attorneys at Kissling, Nestico, and Reddick, this is 19 News. Hi, welcome back. Uh, 19 First Alert meteorologist John Lofman joining us. And John, rainy outside. This is kind of the precursor to what we're going to see uh, for this, the final few days of October. Yeah, yeah, we're winding it down pretty quickly right. and uh, this is a transitional time. Uh, we've had as much as 6.1 inches of snow on Halloween. Are you, uh, the, the, why are no, you saying know. that? So now? listen, I'm trying oh. to I ah. so the silver lining is it's not going <laughs> to happen this year. All right, uh, the waves are very active on the lake and the uh, lake is pretty churned up. And as we uh, head off to Sunday services, maybe at 11 o'clock, 51, maybe you're walking the dog. Notice the break. The showers will be coming in rounds as we make our way through the day. Here's round two, three o'clock in the afternoon. Could we squeeze a 54 out? Yeah, we could do that if we get a little break before the rain cools things down appreciably through the night. And then, yep, yeah, there's the next round. At uh, 7 in the morning, we're talking about temperatures in the mid 40s with showers around. It'll be a mainly morning affair on Monday, but as we make our way through the afternoon, temperatures will climb only to readings in the mid 40s. So we're talking mid 40s to start the day and mid 40s through the afternoon. A 47 can be expected as we make our way to Tuesday morning. Just a little bit of rain shower activity up here across the extreme northeast corner of the state. But look at these temperatures. We're below freezing. The growing season, of course, has ended for many. And there may be some frost around on Tuesday morning for some. Rain. We're talking about amounts of generally a quarter of an inch to half an inch, three tenths of an inch at Mentor, uh, half an inch and a little bit more maybe at Mansfield, where across the southern tier they get a little bit more rain. But Yes, I know. It says snow tracker. Our first alert snow tracker carries us to the snow belt where, of course, generally light accumulations on grassy elevated surfaces in the higher terrain can be expected as we make our way to Wednesday by well, morning anyway, as this rain snow mix transits to uh, snow, uh, particularly in the snow belt. But that'll be about it. Uh, what can we expect down the line? Well, we'll take a look as we welcome November in a first look at the seven day ahead.